sponsored by Penn State York. It's the Feed at Five. Now, here's Joe. Hey guys, welcome back to Feed at Five with your hashtag of the day, tweets you may have missed, and the perfect way to start your week. I'm Jones. Let's feed. Your Space Corps tweets, NASA wants student help to land astronauts on Mars. This couldn't end badly. Most students don't even know what they want to do with their own lives, and if they do, they'll probably change their mind three or four times, but it's okay, because it'll all drive sales to the new Matt Damon movie, The Martian. Men's health has a simple secret to maximizing your calorie burn. This is assuming you overeat in the first place, which, this being America, who are we kidding? Fortune tweets Google's Eric Schmidt has these nine rules for emailing. If you don't know how to email by now, you might as well just try Snapchat. Sure, its interface isn't the greatest, but if you mess up on there, at least it won't be around for long. Today's tech has incredible footage from a GoPro that was lost in space. Why am I not reading this on GoPro's official Twitter? I can't wait to see the first person to take a GoPro to all 50 states via like hot air balloon. There's so many things you can do with these. Because we're concerned about your safety, your hashtag of the day brought to you by Penn State York is, it can wait. Check it out. Mental Floss tweets the 104-year-old street artist who yarn-bombed, yes, yarn-bombed, her town. Wouldn't people just call that littering? I guess when you're that old, what's really gonna stop you anyway? Newsweek tweets this sea otter has the first known case of asthma and is learning to use a human inhaler. While this one under bizarre news doesn't get much odder than this. Washington Post tweets, why the world loves the many resurrections of Doctor Who. If you think about it, this is a genius idea. I mean, make a show that can continue on forever. The downside is they made a show that can continue on forever. Glenn and Amber, this one's for you. All right, everyone, that's our show. Thanks for stopping on by until tomorrow. I'm Jones, stay loud.